All right, back with you once again for some sports. Now, I just want to um, talk a little bit about last night, about the NHL games between Tampa Bay and New York Rangers. Now, I've seen the highlights, and the Rangers, man, they're like scoring a lot of goals and basically shooting the puck in places that confuse, uh, to confuse the Tampa Bay goalie, this Cessny, whatever, I don't know his name, how to say his name, but, uh, you know, they're getting shots in there and putting them in places to, that the Cessny can't get to, get to, you know. So, I guess Tampa Bay will have to make some adjustments on their defense, but um, the way New York Rangers are shooting a puck and getting by the defenders, it's going to be a tough task for Coach John Cooper. And uh, I'm just keeping it real. On the other side of the, of the NHL, got the Oilers playing against the um, Colorado Avalanche. That game is tonight. If we're Game three will be played in Edmonton here. So maybe the Oilers can find some life once again. But um, I gotta say, Colorado has a lot of speed. And um, they can score goals in that big rush. Well, God blame the defenders for Edmonton. Uh, Darnell Nurse has been a, somewhat of a non factor, and Evander Kane, too. And don't get me started with, uh, what's his name? Conor, Mc, Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor, Conor, I forgot his last name. It's his name, I forgot his last name. But he's a good player, playing along with uh, Nathan, uh, Nathan McCannell, Conor McGregor. I forgot his name. I remember his name. But, uh, yeah, he's been a non-factor, too. So Edmonton will have to make s some adjustments. I hope they did. Just find a way to stop in Colorado's rush. So Edmonton and Tampa Bay are down two games in their series. And that's just... Uh, all I have for this uh, commentary on sports in the NHL.